I've been studying every F1 track in reverse so that I can see the tracks from a different perspective and so that I can see more corners for my own driving and coaching practice. This is Miami and it was a very low grip. We're straight into a decreasing radius corner by the way here. So similar to our last one in Silverstone. When things are low grip, we're talking tight lines, short corners, more separation of the driving input elements and generally just more progression with the inputs as well. It's almost like as if it's wet. So trust me, if you do this in reverse with no assist, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about because honestly, it's like ice. So here's a bit of a short corner and here's some progression with steering and throttle just as I come onto this straight as well. Remember that decreasing radius corners and increasing radius corners are the reverse in reverse. So we're coming into a decreasing radius corner here, which is now increasing radius. So you just got to be careful with your steering opening and traction delivery as well. We've got some S's here. I found honestly some more grip on the curbs than I did on the racetrack. And we've got more S's and direction change coming up here as well. So important to create a nice flat, stable platform before the next direction change. You see me get through here, not too badly as well. Give it a go if you want to practice very low grip conditions and let me know your thoughts and questions in the comments below.